I think a developer would look like a geek, nerdy, clad, unshaven, glasses, spiky hair, beards. A guy behind a door that's got enough of a crack they can slide a pizza underneath. I think you won't even know who a developer is. I think you'd be surprised. I really don't know what a developer looks like, but the apps they make let us do amazing things. You can talk about a project, you can articulate it rationally, but you cannot communicate architectural ideas without a drawing. I use an app called Paper by 53. It really provides a sense of freedom, a sense of being emancipated from technology. It allows you to communicate as if directly from your heart, from your soul. It's just part of you. And I think that, that magic is part of the app world. The app I cannot live without is a banking app named the Zhihu Bao. Airbnb saved my life. I talked to my friends. Instagram, Tumblr. Like blah, 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 blah. Have a note. That's the one. I'm addicted to Pinterest because it is amazing. There's so much entertainment. Dog face. It's, it's limitless what you can do. The ocean, for me, is the lungs of our planet. The health of the ocean is absolutely essential to the health of us as human beings. Pangea runs a sailing expedition vessel to help scientists collect data on marine debris all around the world. There's a variety of apps that I use every day. iNavX is essential for us to be able to navigate the vessel. Marine Debris Tracker allows you to enter the marine debris you find into a global database so we can start to build up a bigger picture of this problem around the world. I think these apps are essential for us to be able to bring change to what's going on in the ocean. Best app of all time has to be Tinder. I'm most probably like the, the millions of people that's got sucked into to Candy Crush. Robot Unicorn Attack 2. Crazy girl looking to meet new people in London. Interesting. Words of friends, Scrabble. I play solitaire. And of course I always win. We are stewards of, of dreams and hope for, for hitters. They come in and they want to achieve uh, amazing things and that's, that's my job. Darkfish has just made my life so much easier. I'm able to break down the swing into parts so that you can see, okay, here's the mistake and here's the adjustment that I need to make. So what you have is a kid that can not only do it right, but then you can train him on doing it over and over and over. Now they're able to look and say, you know what, I'm getting better. And that's one of the things that you need for life in general, but in sports, you want hope. And so now it's easy for them to focus on dreaming. We need like a silence finder app. I gravitate toward very uh, melancholy and painful songs. It's time to turn the page. Whoop. This has become as essential as my guitar. There are apps that help people, that it, like really improve people's lives. Every now and then I'll sort of stare at the hand with this sense of sort of wonder, going, wow. And it is like magic, it really is. In combination with the hand, the app has allowed me to gain functionality and independence. I, I enjoy being known as the kid with a bionic arm. You know, it's something interesting, it's something different, and I'm, I'm a big fan of being different. You open up an app, and you, you open up a, a possibility, and the whole world is being born. What we really have is an intersection between technology and art. You see the world in a different way, and I think an app can do that because it really does open something you didn't know beforehand. Developers are doing extraordinary things. I can't believe what they're creating today. It's genius. If I met the person that made Sky Go, I'd probably give him a massive hug. You inspire me so much. They make our lives better, and they think of things that obviously regular people can't think of. I don't know how the technology works. It's just magic to me. <laughs> There's no question they are changing the world. So to everyone who's made any apps that I've ever enjoyed, I say thank you.